Hey there, how's it going everybody? So today I'm going to show you how to use Salesforce Inbox for Gmail. And just to clear up some confusion here, Salesforce Inbox refers to either the Google Chrome extension or the Outlook app in which you can integrate Outlook with Salesforce natively. Now I'm going to use Gmail here and the Salesforce Chrome extension. And that's because I'm a Gmail user and I'll take you through an example of how it works and what it looks like. So let's get started. So in this case, I have a contact here named Gmail Integration, and they have an email, which I'm going to copy that email address and I'm going to send them an email. So let's go ahead and do that. So now that we've sent that email, you'll notice that this pop-up has shown up here and it's suggesting that I link that email to that contact and you can also attach it to an account here. And you can have this checkbox checked off here, which is a pop-up, which will pop up every time you send an email and it will remind you to log that email. Or you can turn this off and then have it so that it doesn't pop up, but you will have to remember to log emails. So now I'll go ahead and click log. Now we go back to the contact here and I refresh the page you'll see that email here has been sent and this is an outbound email. Now let's do the example of inbound emails. Now I'll show you what happens when I get an inbound email. So I'll go to my other email here. Here I received the email. I'm going to go ahead and reply. And I'm gonna say, hi, I got the email. Thank you. Send that. Now that is a sent email. So we'll go back to my inbox here. Refresh this. Wait until we receive that email. Here we go. So here's an inbound email. Now, this hasn't been logged yet, right? So this is the problem I have with Salesforce inbox is it doesn't just auto log that email. So if I refresh this, you'll see that the inbound message has still not been logged. And that is my issue with it. So if I go down here, I can click log and now the email has been logged. So, you know, it's nice to have a system that logs it. The issue is that it doesn't do it automatically. And if it was doing that, then I would like the solution a lot better. However, it is manual and you're going to have to live with that. So, I will leave this video at that and I'm going to go over in the next video a third party integration that I use, which is Apollo. Um, I don't necessarily recommend Apollo, but it is a better solution in my opinion because it's more automated.